we got to have a conversation this morning. I was taking a look at uh, the front page of the Daily Nation. And on the front page, they were taking a look at the changes that are going to be made in as far as grade 1 to 9 students are concerned in the competency-based curriculum. Uh, according to the ministry, when I say about boarding schools, are going to be abolished as far as uh, January Kifika. So how the top story in so many boarding schools are shock for parents. Now, on page two and three, they've taken a look at this quite keenly, where they say in a move that caught families unawares, the government yesterday shaped or rather slapped a ban on registrations of new boarding schools for children in grade one to nine and any form of boarding for junior secondary school. Uh, children from pastoralist communities will, however, be exempted from the new rule. And according to them, they say they want to make education more affordable because to Q easy boarding schools in Amanisha, lazima kwena doiko allocated to dormitories to ensuring that our oh, total naitaji food and all the other things that are going to sustain them in boarding schools. But before we go into the benefits, the pros and cons, let's just make a bit of stories right here. Ebu tupige story kidogo. Experience yako, the first time you went into boarding because me, I think boarding was the worst thing for me on earth. Me, me nilikuwa baby girl, before boarding school and I started boarding in uh, Form 1. Na boarding enye lienda ni Kenya High. Na bado likuwa na complain. Because prior to that, Mama Tamima and Likwana Toka knew, and Likwana Toka Shuleni, Nafka Nyumbani, and Apatam and Pikia via Zikarai, Amen Pikia, Amenekea Pale Maziwa, Amekwekea fruits, and then Unaulizo, how your day was, Unapatia story, and Nanya Mexumbo Shule, and all of that. And then now you go to Madrasa, and then Unaida, Unarudi una Ulale, Uki have your supper. And then I go to boarding school where I don't have anyone to make stories with. I'm doing everything for myself, I'm washing my own clothes, I'm doing all these chores. Me and Yen Ilkwan and Matthias Obila Chuki. When I rasta man, your first experience with your boarding school. Uh, for me, I'm really in Bambasana because I nakumbuka, nakumbuka nili maliza, nili maliza class eight. Remember I told the story, Jana, who eh. was a Ocha. Yeah. It happened after I finished class eight. Mm-hmm. Minwe pele ko Ocha after any Christmas holiday. Yeah. Eh, mzazi kumbi a meni acha ushagua men, ameru, amerudi, mtani bana. Ni me acha umbake le time sasa tunaitoa kwa secondary school. Yeah. Ni kambi wa option ni moja. Eh. Uh-huh. Either wende boarding school, mm-hmm. ama wende ile kunele shule na kwanga kamiti pale. Guy. Mi, mi, I was, I, was, I was that bad. So I was in boarding school one time. I was in the machacos. I was in the machacos. Uh-huh. The experience was actually awesome because uh, siku na y- your feeling ya kuka outside home una juone zafanya whatever. Yeah. Mzazi ya yuko hapo kukukazia. Hakuna yeah. machoza kuenda kutunga ngombe ama uh-huh. nini. So mi yangu ilikuwa vibes kwa vibes. Kwa uh-huh. na majibarede kwa shida kwa angu kwa <laughs> ushago. Ushago tu kwa tunafanya kwa daily. Yeah. Yeah. So it was a good experience. So for you it was freedom is coming freedom. tomorrow. Freedom. Hallelujah. But unfortunately siku kaa body in four years. Okay, what happened? Nilika mpaka tu for it's just a total wreck. Oh god. So mother mother ni tu akasema acha tutoe kijana asiibiwe asi kila saa. Kila saa nampigia amebiwa. Uniform imepotea. Mm. Kidogo kidogo naona beseni yangu iko kwa dormitory ya form 4. Wanaibadi boxer. Mingine na wame, it was bad. Serious. It was bad. So Lakini wewe ukiwa nyumbani, ukiwa uko kwa barabara na joko kwa mat na unacheka tu. If you went to boarding school in primary school because mine and Mana Rastaman's experiences is a high school. Kauli and boarding Raima. How was your experience like before we go into the pros and cons before we go any further? Ebu to let to story to kwanza. Tuma voice note on 0710674674. But kama meza andika mesunja andika to pia taisoma by the hashtag Energy Breakfast Club tag us at Energy Radio Kenya across all social media platforms. 97.1 Energy Radio. Energy Radio.